shampoo. Noun. A traditional Indian and Persian body massage given after pouring warm water over the body and rubbing it with extracts from herbs. Verb. To wash one's own hair with shampoo. Endeavor. Noun. A sincere attempt. A determined or assiduous effort towards a specific goal. Assiduous or persistent activity. Verb. To exert oneself. Age. Noun. The whole duration of a being. Whether animal, plant, or other kind. Being alive. Verb. To cause to grow old. To impart the characteristics of age to. Patient. Noun. A person or animal who receives treatment from a doctor or other medically educated person. Adjective. Of a person. Willing to wait if necessary. Not losing one's temper while waiting. Prescribe. Verb. To order. A drug or medical device. For use by a particular patient. Under licensed authority. Mirror. Noun. A smooth surface. Usually made of glass with reflective material painted on the underside. That reflects light so as to give an image of what is in front of it. Verb. Of an event. Activity. Behavior. Etc. To be identical to. To be a copy of. Nonsense. Noun. Letters or words. In writing or speech. That have no meaning or pattern or seem to have no meaning. Verb. To make nonsense of. Adjective. Resulting from the substitution of a nucleotide in a sense codon. Causing it to become a stop codon. Not coding for an amino acid. Interjection. An emphatic rejection of something one has just heard and does not believe or agree with. Stability. Noun. The condition of being stable or in equilibrium, and thus resistant to change. Capacity. Noun. The ability to hold, receive or absorb. Adjective. Filling the allotted space. Fries. Noun. Usually in the plural. Fries. A fried strip of potato. Verb. A method of cooking food. Noun. A kind of sieve. Squirrel. Noun. Any of the rodents of the family Sciuridae distinguished by their large bushy tail. Verb. To store in a secretive manner. To hide something for future use. Cast. Noun. An act of throwing. Verb. Physical. To move, or be moved, away. Reflected. Verb. To bend back. Light. Etc. From a surface. Adjective. Bent or sent back. Especially of incident sound or light. Attempt. Noun. The action of trying at something. Verb. To try. Equality. Noun. The fact of being equal. Rare. Noun. A scarce or uncommon item. Adjective. Very uncommon. Scarce. Candles. Noun. A light source consisting of a wick embedded in a solid, flammable substance such as wax, tallow, or paraffin. Verb. To observe the growth of an embryo inside an egg. Using a bright light source. Dig. Noun. An archaeological or paleontological investigation. Or the site where such an investigation is taking place. Verb. To move hard-packed earth out of the way. Especially downward to make a hole with a shovel. Or to drill. Or the like. Through rocks. Roads. Or the like. More generally. To make any similar hole by moving material out of the way. Pencil. Noun. A paintbrush. Verb. To write. Something. Using a pencil. Prepared. Verb. To make ready for a specific future purpose. To set up. To assemble or equip. Adjective. Followed by the preposition to. Disposed. Willing. Ready. To do something. Nights. Adverb. At night. Hiring. Verb. To obtain the services of in return for fixed payment. Noun. The act by which an employee is hired. Spooky. Adjective. Eerie, or suggestive of ghosts or the supernatural. Absolutely. Adverb. In an absolute or unconditional manner. Utterly. Positively. Holy. Interjection. Yes. Certainly. Expression indicating strong agreement. Alternatives. Noun. 
a situation which allows a mutually exclusive choice between two or more possibilities. A choice between two or more possibilities. Classes. Noun. A group. Collection. Category or set sharing characteristics or attributes. Verb. To assign to a class. To classify. Noun. A class or order. Sort. Kind. Compared. Verb. To assess the similarities and differences between two or more things. To compare X with Y. Having made the comparison of X with Y, one might have found it similar to Y or different from Y. Explain. Verb. To make plain. Manifest. Or intelligible. To clear of obscurity. To illustrate the meaning of. Closing. Verb. Physical. To remove a gap. Noun. The act by which something is closed. Adjective. Pertaining to the finish or ending of a series of events. Occurring at the end or after all others. Monster. Noun. A terrifying and dangerous creature. Verb. To make into a monster. To categorize as a monster. To demonize. Adjective. Very large. Worthy of a monster. Recognize. Verb. To match. Something or someone which one currently perceives. To a memory of some previous encounter with the same person or thing. Emigrated. Verb. To leave the country in which one lives. Especially one's native country. In order to reside elsewhere. Now. Noun. The present time. Adjective. Present. Current. Adverb. At the present time. Conjunction. Since. Because. In light of the fact. Often with that. Interjection. Indicates a signal to begin. Lead. Noun. A heavy, pliable, inelastic metal element, having a bright, bluish color, but easily tarnished, both malleable and ductile, though with little tenacity, it is easily fusible, forms alloys with other metals, and is an ingredient of solder and type metal. Atomic number 82, symbol PB, from Latin plumbum, verb, to cover, fill, or affect with lead, composed. Verb, to make something by merging parts. Adjective, showing composure. Retail. Noun, the sale of goods directly to the consumer. Encompassing the storefronts, mail order, websites, etc., and the corporate mechanisms, branding, advertising, etc., that support them. Verb, to sell at retail, or in small quantities directly to customers. Adjective. Of or relating to the actual or figurative sale of goods or services directly to individuals. Adverb. Direct to consumers. In retail quantities. Or at retail prices. Follows. Noun. Sometimes attributive. In billiards and similar games. A stroke causing a ball to follow another ball after hitting it. Verb. To go after. To pursue. To move behind in the same path or direction. Ghosts. Noun. The spirit. The soul of man. Verb. To haunt. To appear to in the form of an apparition. Fascination. Noun. The act of bewitching, or enchanting. Decide. Verb. To resolve. A contest. Problem. Dispute. Etc. To choose. Determine. Or settle. Damage. Noun. Injury or harm. The condition or measure of something not being intact. Verb. To impair the soundness, goodness, or value of. To harm or cause destruction. Annotations. Noun. A critical or explanatory commentary or analysis. Airplanes. Noun. A powered heavier than air aircraft with fixed wings. Verb. To fly in an aeroplane. Pick. Noun. A tool used for digging. A pickaxe. Verb. To grasp and pull with the fingers or fingernails. Diet. Noun. The food and beverage a person or animal consumes. Adjective. Of a food or beverage. Containing less fat. Salt. Sugar. Or calories than normal. Are claimed to have such. Illustration. Noun. The act of illustrating. 
the act of making clear and distinct education also the state of being illustrated or of being made clear and distinct outlined verb to draw an outline of reconcile verb to restore a friendly relationship to bring back to harmony somebody noun a recognized or important person a celebrity pronoun some unspecified person desserts noun a sweet confection served as the last course of a meal quote noun a quotation a statement attributed to a person verb to repeat the exact words of a person curling verb to cause to move in a curve noun the action or motion of something that curls or is curled clouds noun a rock boulder a hill verb to become foggy or gloomy or obscured from sight sore noun an injured infected inflamed or diseased patch of skin verb to mutilate the legs or feet of a horse in order to induce a particular gait adjective causing pain or discomfort painfully sensitive adverb very excessively extremely of something bad grade noun a rating verb to assign scores to the components of an academic test debate noun an argument or discussion usually in an ordered or formal setting often with more than two people generally ending with a vote or other decision verb to participate in a debate to dispute argue especially in a public arena liberal noun one with liberal views supporting individual liberty see wikipedia's article on liberalism adjective now rare outside set phrases pertaining to those arts and sciences the study of which is considered to provide general knowledge as opposed to vocational occupational technical or mechanical training painting verb to apply paint to noun an illustration or artwork done with the use of paint clue noun a strand of yarn etc as used to guide one through a labyrinth something which points the way a guide verb to provide with a clue opportunities noun a chance for advancement progress or profit researched verb to search or examine with continued care to seek diligently herself pronoun reflexive pronoun her the female object of a verb or preposition that also appears as the subject adaptation noun the process of adapting something or becoming adapted to a situation adjustment modification pad noun a flattened mass of anything soft to sit or lie on verb to stuff crossword noun games puzzles a word puzzle in which interlocking words are entered usually horizontally and vertically into a grid based on clues given for each word businesses noun a specific commercial enterprise or establishment napkin noun a serviette a usually rectangular piece of cloth or paper used at the table for wiping the mouth and hands for cleanliness while eating foundations noun the act of founding fixing establishing or beginning to erect employee noun an individual who provides labor to a company or another person balancing verb to bring items to an equipoise as the scales of a balance by adjusting the weights noun an action wherein someone balances or something is balanced definite noun grammar a word or phrase that designates a specified or identified person or entity adjective having distinct limits emergencies noun a situation which poses an immediate risk and which requires urgent attention prohibited verb to forbid disallow or proscribe officially to make illegal or illicit adjective forbidden unallowed issues noun the action or an instance of flowing or coming out an outflow particularly 
Verb. To flow out. To proceed from. To come out or from. Decency. Noun. The quality of being decent. Propriety. Expect. Verb. To predict or believe that something will happen. Relevancy. Noun. Sufficiency. Of a statement. Claim etc. To carry weight in law. Legal pertinence. Brewing. Verb. To make tea or coffee by mixing tea leaves or coffee beans with hot water. Noun. The production of alcoholic beverages. Such as beer. By fermentation. The process of being brewed. Pathetic. Adjective. Arousing pity, sympathy, or compassion. Breakfast. Noun. The first meal of the day. Usually eaten in the morning. Verb. To eat the morning meal. Must. Noun. Something that is mandatory or required. Verb. Modal auxiliary. Defective. To do with certainty. Indicates that the speaker is certain that the subject will have executed the predicate. Statement. Noun. A declaration or remark. Guys. Noun. An effigy of a man burned on a bonfire on the anniversary of the gunpowder plot. The 5th of November. Verb. To exhibit an effigy of Guy Fox around the 5th of November. Noun. A guide. A leader or conductor. Verb. To equip with a support cable. Spiral. Noun. A curve that is the locus of a point that rotates about a fixed point while continuously increasing. Its distance from that point. Verb. To move along the path of a spiral or helix. Adjective. Helical. Like a spiral. Convenient. Adjective. Serving to reduce a difficulty, or accessible with minimum difficulty. Expedient. Naughty. Adjective. Mischievous. Tending to misbehave or act badly, especially of a child. Pixel. Noun. One of the tiny dots that make up the representation of an image in a computer's memory. Verb. To create computer graphics by editing individual pixels. Cleaning. Verb. To remove dirt from a place or object. Noun. Gerund of clean. The process of making something clean. Polygons. Noun. A plain figure bounded by edges that are all straight lines. Invisible. Noun. An invisible person or thing. Specifically. God. The supreme being. Verb. To make invisible. To invisibilize. Adjective. Unable to be seen. Out of sight. Not visible. Occupation. Noun. An activity or task with which one occupies oneself. Usually specifically the productive activity. Service. Trade. Or craft for which one is regularly paid. A job. Rates. Noun. The worth of something. Value. Verb. To assign or be assigned a particular rank or level. Verb. To berate. Scold. Noun. British. New Zealand. Or Australian. Taxes. Usually on property. Levied by local government. Physicist. Noun. A person whose occupation specializes in the science of physics. Especially at a professional level. P. Noun. Urine. Verb. To urinate. Outsourcing. Verb. To transfer the management and or day-to-day -day execution of a business function to a third party. Service provider. Noun. The transfer of a business function to an external service provider. Geography. Noun. A description of the earth. A treatise or textbook on geography. An atlas or gazetteer. Copies. Noun. The result of copying. An identical duplicate of an original. Verb. To produce an object identical to a given object. Greatly. Adverb. To a great extent or degree. Dates. Noun. The fruit of the date palm. Phoenix dactylifera. Somewhat in the shape of an olive. Containing a soft. Sweet pulp and enclosing a hard kernel. Noun. The addition to a writing. Inscription. Coin. Etc. Which specifies the time. Especially the day. Month. And year. When the writing or inscription was given. Executed. Or made. Verb. To note the time or place of writing or executing. 
to express in an instrument the time of its execution. Spooky. Adjective. Eerie, or suggestive of ghosts or the supernatural. Double. Noun. Twice the number. Amount. Size. Etc. Verb. To multiply by two. Adjective. Made up of two matching or complementary elements. Adverb. Twice over. Twofold. Doubly. Noun. The double time. A marching cadence. Pace. Approaching running speed. Career. Noun. One's calling in life. A person's occupation. One's profession. Verb. To move rapidly straight ahead. Especially in an uncontrolled way. Directions. Noun. A theoretical line. Physically or mentally. Followed from a point of origin or towards a destination. May be relative. E.g. up. Left. Outbound. Dorsal. Geographical. E.g. north. Rotational. E.g. clockwise. Or with respect to an object or location. E.g. toward Boston. Noun. Instructions for how to reach a destination or how to do something. Prosecution. Noun. The act of prosecuting a scheme or endeavor. Sixth. Noun. Not used in the plural. The person or thing in the sixth position. Verb. To divide by six. Which also means multiplying a denominator by six. Adjective. The ordinal form of the number six. Engineer. Noun. A person who is qualified or professionally engaged in any branch of engineering. Verb. To design. Construct or manage something as an engineer. Investigator. Noun. One who investigates. Shelf. Noun. A flat. Rigid structure. Fixed at right angles to a wall or forming a part of a cabinet. Desk etc. And used to support. Store or display objects. Actuary. Noun. Registrar. Clerk. Signatures. Noun. A person's name. Written by that person. Used as identification or to signify approval of accompanying material. Such as a legal contract. Cancelled. Verb. To cross out something with lines etc. Adjective. No longer planned or scheduled. Media. Noun. The middle layer of the wall of a blood vessel or lymph vessel which is composed of connective and muscular tissue. Pound. Noun. A unit of mass equal to 16 avoirdupois ounces. Equals 453.59237 grams. Today this value is the most common meaning of pound as a unit of weight. Conditioning. Verb. To subject to the process of acclimation. Noun. The process of modifying a person or animal's behavior. Band. Noun. A strip of material used for strengthening or coupling. Verb. To fasten with a band. Fiber. Noun. A single elongated piece of a given material. Roughly round in cross-section. Often twisted with other fibers to form thread. No. Noun. Knowledge. The state of knowing. Verb. To perceive the truth or factuality of. To be certain of or that. Shocked. Verb. To cause to be emotionally shocked. To cause. Someone. To feel surprised and upset. Verb. To collect. Or make up. Into a shock or shocks. To stook. Adjective. Surprised. Startled. Confused. Or taken aback. Inspires. Verb. To infuse into the mind. To communicate to the spirit. To convey. As by a divine or supernatural influence. To disclose preternaturally. To produce in. As by inspiration. Correctly. Adverb. In a correct manner. Astronaut. Noun. A member of the crew of a spaceship or other spacecraft that travels beyond Earth's atmosphere. Or someone trained to serve that purpose. Exactly. Adverb. Manner. Without approximation. Precisely. Interjection. Signifies agreement or recognition. Proposal. Noun. Something which is proposed, or offered for consideration or acceptance. Dutch. Noun. Wife. Occurring. Verb. To happen or take place. Noun. An instance of something occurring. 
an event or happening, adjective, in combination, that occurs in a specified manner. Roar. Noun, one who rose. Developed. Verb, to change with a specific direction. Progress. Adjective, set of a country, not primitive, not third world. Rocks. Noun, an enormous mythical bird in Eastern legend. Noun, rock uranium. Noun, a formation of minerals. Specifically, noun, an act of rocking, a rocking motion, a sway. Verb, to move gently back and forth. Verb, to play, perform, or enjoy rock music, especially with a lot of skill or energy. Noun, distaff. Noun, money, anywhere. Adverb, in or at any location or an unknown location. Pronoun, any location or an unknown location. Namespaces. Noun. A conceptual space that groups classes. Identifiers. Etc. To avoid conflicts with items in unrelated code that have the same names. Juice. Noun. A liquid from a plant. Especially fruit. Verb. To extract the juice from something. Dislike. Noun. An attitude or a feeling of distaste or aversion. Verb. To displease. To offend. In third person only. Charm. Noun. An object. Act or words believed to have magic power. Usually carries a positive connotation. Verb. To seduce. Persuade or fascinate someone or something. Probably. Adverb. In all likelihood. Final. Noun. A final examination. A test or examination given at the end of a term or class. The test that concludes a class. Adjective. Last. Ultimate. Flower. Noun. A colorful. Conspicuous structure associated with angiosperms. Frequently scented and attracting various insects. And which may or may not be used for sexual reproduction. Verb. To put forth blooms. Raining. Verb. To have rain fall from the sky. Noun. A fall of rain. Doll. Noun, a toy in the form of a human. Blade. Noun, the sharp cutting edge of a knife. Chisel, or other tool. A razor blade, sword. Verb, to skate on rollerblades. Noun, a kind of piton used in thin cracks. Pajamas. Noun, clothes for wearing to bed and sleeping in. Usually consisting of a loose-fitting shirt and pants, trousers. Divide. Noun. A thing that divides. Verb. To split or separate something into two or more parts. Bricklayer. Noun. A craftsman who builds walls and such like out of bricks. Annotations. Noun. A critical or explanatory commentary or analysis. Sharp. Noun. The symbol sharp. Placed after the name of a note in the key signature or before a note on the staff to indicate that. The note is to be played a semitone higher. Verb. To raise the pitch of a note half a step making a natural note a sharp. Adjective. Terminating in a point or edge. Especially one that can cut easily. Not obtuse or rounded. Adverb. To a point or edge. Piercingly. Eagerly. Sharply. Prescriptive. Adjective. Of or pertaining to prescribing or enjoining. Especially an action or behavior based on a norm or standard. Focal. Adjective. Belonging to. Concerning. Or located at a focus. Sniggers. Verb. To emit a snigger. Illegal. Noun. An illegal act or technique. Adjective. Contrary to or forbidden by law. Especially criminal law. Guitar. Noun. A stringed musical instrument. Of European origin. Usually with a fretted fingerboard and six strings. Played with the fingers or a plectrum. Guitar pick. Verb. To play the guitar. Reports. Noun. A piece of information describing. Or an account of certain events given or presented to someone. With the most common adpositions being by. Referring to creator of the report. And on. Referring to the subject. Verb. To relate details of. An event or incident. To recount. Describe. 
something overwhelming verb to engulf surge over and submerge noun a situation of being overwhelmed adjective overpowering staggering or irresistibly strong rest noun of a person or animal relief from work or activity by sleeping sleep invaluable adjective of great value costly precious priceless barber noun a person whose profession is cutting usually male custom as hair and beards verb to cut the hair or beard of a person spoonful noun the amount that a spoon will hold either level or heaped biggest adjective of great size large certainty noun the state of being certain greek noun an inhabitant resident or person of descent from greece verb to display a placeholder instead of text especially to optimize speed in displaying text that would be too small to read reasonable adjective having the faculty of reason rational reasoning boil noun a localized accumulation of pus in the skin resulting from infection nap noun a short period of sleep especially one during the day verb to have a nap to sleep for a short period of time especially during the day democracy noun rule by the people especially as a form of government either directly or through elected representatives representative democracy participating verb to join in to take part to involve oneself in something obtain verb to get hold of to gain possession of to procure to acquire in any way hundred noun a hundred dollar bill or any other note denominated 100 e.g. a hundred euros numeral a numerical value equal to 100 102 occurring after 99 architect noun a professional who designs buildings or other structures or who prepares plans and superintends construction verb to design plan or orchestrate besides adverb also in addition preposition in addition in addition to force out noun an instance of an out created by touching a base in advance of a runner who has no base to return to while in possession of a ball which has already touched the ground verb to cause something to be ejected respect noun an attitude of consideration or high regard verb to have respect for interjection hello hi productive adjective capable of producing something especially in abundance fertile chain noun a series of interconnected rings or links usually made of metal verb to fasten something with a chain fried adjective cooked by frying verb a method of cooking food anna noun a unit of currency in former British India equal to 12 pies or 1 16th rupee. Machinist. Noun. A constructor of machines and engines. One versed in the principles of machines. Placeholder. Noun. Something used or included temporarily or as a substitute for something that is not known or must. Remain generic. That which holds denotes or reserves a place for something to come later depth noun the vertical distance below a surface the degree to which something is deep elders noun an older person or an older member usually a leader of some community verb to admonish or reprove for improper conduct by the elders of the meeting noun a small tree sambucus nigra having white flowers in a cluster and edible purple berries messages noun a communication or what is communicated any concept or information conveyed verb to send a message to to transmit a message to e.g. as text via a cell phone noun shopping groceries errands adrenaline noun epinephrine the hormone and neurotransmitter 
managed. Verb, to direct or be in charge of. Portal. Noun. An entrance. Entry point. Or means of entry. Adjective. Of or relating to a porta. Especially the porta of the liver. Quarantines. Noun. The desert in which Christ fasted for forty days according to the Bible. Noun. A sanitary measure to prevent the spread of a contagious plague by isolating those believed or feared to be infected. Apricot. Noun. A round sweet and juicy stone fruit. Resembling peach or plum in taste. With a yellow-orange flesh. Lightly fuzzy skin and a large seed inside. Adjective. Of a pale yellowish-orange color. Like that of an apricot. Shared. Verb. To give part of what one has to somebody else to use or consume. Verb. To cut. To shear. To cleave. To divide. Adjective. Used by multiple entities or for multiple purposes or in multiple ways. Duck. Verb. To quickly lower the head or body in order to prevent it from being struck by something. Informed. Verb. To instruct. Train. Usually in matters of knowledge. Adjective. Instructed. Having knowledge of a fact or area of education. Fill in. Verb. To fill. To replace material that is absent or has been removed. Board. Noun. A relatively long, wide and thin piece of any material. Usually wood or similar. Often for use in construction or furniture making. Verb. To step or climb onto or otherwise enter a ship. Aircraft. Train or other conveyance. Good. Adjective. Of people. Interjection. That is good. An elliptical exclamation of satisfaction or commendation. Cancelled. Verb. To cross out something with lines etc. Adjective. No longer planned or scheduled. Infrared. Noun. Electromagnetic radiation of a wavelength longer than visible light. But shorter than microwave radiation. Having a wavelength between 700 nanometers and 1 millimeter. Adjective. Having the wavelength in the infrared. Cope. Verb. To deal effectively with something, especially if difficult. It's. Noun. One who is neither a he nor a she. A creature. A dehumanized being. Pronoun. The one. Or ones. Belonging to it. Prefers. Verb. To be in the habit of choosing something rather than something else. To favor. To like better. Scale. Noun. A ladder. A series of steps. A means of ascending. Verb. To change the size of something whilst maintaining proportion. Especially to change a process in order to produce much larger amounts of the final product. Kicking. Verb. To strike or hit with the foot or other extremity of the leg. Verb. To die. Noun. The action of the verb to kick. Adjective. Terrific. Great. Of clothes. Smart. Fashionable. Exit. Noun. An act of going out or going away. Or leaving. A departure. Verb. To go out or go away from a place or situation. To depart. To leave. Crunch. Noun. A noisy crackling sound. The sound usually associated with crunching. Verb. To crush something. Especially food. With a noisy crackling sound. Ceiling. Verb. To line or finish. A surface. Such as a wall. With plaster. Stucco. Thin boards. Or similar. Noun. The overhead closure of a room. Purposing. Verb. To have set as one's purpose. Resolve to accomplish. Intend. Plan. Noun. The act of forming a purpose. Drawn. Verb. To move or develop something. Adjective. Appearing tired and unwell. As from stress. Haggard. Seemed. Verb. To appear. To look outwardly. To be perceived as. Retain. Verb. To keep in possession or use. Intensive. Noun. Form of a word with a stronger or more forceful sense than the root on which the intensive is built. Adjective. Thorough. To a great degree. With intensity. Mirror. Noun. A smooth surface. 
usually made of glass with reflective material painted on the underside that reflects light so as to give an image of what is in front of it. Verb of an event, activity, behavior, etc. To be identical to, to be a copy of. Fat noun, a specialized animal tissue with a high oil content, used for long-term storage of energy. Verb to make fat, to fatten. Adjective carrying more fat than usual on one's body. Plump not lean or thin. Adjective. Originally African American vernacular English. Excellent. Cool. Very good. Helping. Verb. To provide assistance to. Someone or something. Noun. A portion or serving. Especially of food that one takes for oneself. Or to which one helps oneself. Magic. Noun. The application of rituals or actions especially those based on occult knowledge, to subdue or manipulate natural or supernatural beings and forces in order to have some benefit from them. Verb. To produce. Transform. Something. As if. By magic. Adjective. Having supernatural talents. Properties or qualities attributed to magic. Outputs. Noun. Production. Quantity produced. Created are completed. Verb. To produce. Create. Are complete. Buyers. Noun. A person who makes one or more purchases. Concepts. Noun. An abstract and general idea. An abstraction. Danish. Noun. Danish pastry. Light sweet yeast raised roll usually filled with fruit or cheese. Including. Verb. To bring into a group. Class. Set or total as a new part or member preposition such as among which introducing one or more parts of the group or topic just mentioned sense verb to make something such as an object or message go from one place to another brewing verb to make tea or coffee by mixing tea leaves or coffee beans with hot water noun the production of alcoholic beverages, such as beer, by fermentation, the process of being brewed. Force. Noun. Strength or energy of body or mind. Active power. Vigor. Might. Capacity of exercising an influence or producing an effect. Verb. To violate. A woman. To rape. Noun. Law enforcement. Any police organization. A constabulary. Relevancy. Noun. Sufficiency. Of a statement. Claim etc. To carry weight in law. Legal pertinence. Location. Noun. A particular point or place in physical space. Stand. Noun. The act of standing. Verb. Heading. To position or be positioned physically. Expand. Verb. To change. Something. From a smaller form and or size to a larger one. To spread out or lay open. Drop out. Verb. To leave. School. A race. Etc. Prematurely and voluntarily. Stick. Noun. An elongated piece of wood or similar material. Typically put to some use. For example as a wand or baton. Verb. To cut a piece of wood to be the stick member of a cope and stick joint appears. Verb. To come or be in sight. To be in view. To become visible. Potentially. Adverb. In a manner showing much potential. With the possibility of happening in a given way. Mine. Pronoun. My. Belonging to me. That which belongs to me. Blender. Noun. A machine outfitted with sharp blades. For mashing. Crushing or liquefying food ingredients. G. Noun. A gangster. Gangsta. Noun. Games. The statistic reporting the number of games that a player has participated in. Noun. A photograph or video shared on this service. Noun. A unit of gravitational acceleration. Noun. Grammar. Noun case used to express some relationship such as possession or origin. It corresponds roughly to the English preposition of and the suffix s. Noun. 
a unit of mass equal to one thousandth of a kilogram. Symbol. G. Noun. A leguminous plant grown for its seeds. Especially the chickpea. Noun. Grandmother. Breathtakingly. Adverb. In a breathtaking manner. Brick. Noun. A hardened rectangular block of mud. Clay etc. Used for building. Verb. To build with bricks. Adjective. Of weather. Extremely cold. Pink. Noun. The common minnow. Foxinus foxinus. Spray. Noun. A fine. Gentle. Dispersed mist of liquid. Verb. To project a liquid in a dispersive manner toward something. Reader. Noun. A person who reads. Cluttered. Verb. To fill something with clutter. Adjective. Scattered with a disorderly mixture of objects that take up space. Littered. Ration. Noun. A portion of some limited resource allocated to a person or group. Verb. To supply with a ration. To limit. Someone. To a specific allowance of something. Advertiser. Noun. One who advertises. Explanatory. Adjective. Intended to serve as an explanation. Problems. Noun. A difficulty that has to be resolved or dealt with. Expected. Verb. To predict or believe that something will happen. Adjective. Anticipated. Thought to be about to arrive or occur. Convince. Verb. To make someone believe or feel sure about something. Especially by using logic, argument or evidence. Rear. Verb. To bring up to maturity, as offspring. To educate. To instruct. To foster. Pajamas. Noun. Clothes for wearing to bed and sleeping in. Usually consisting of a loose-fitting shirt and pants, trousers. Discotheque. Noun. Slightly obsolete. A nightclub where dancing takes place. Staging. Verb. To produce on a stage. To perform a play. Noun. A performance of a play. Pass out. Verb. To faint. To become unconscious. Deployment. Noun. An arrangement or classification of things. Cancelled. Verb. To cross out something with lines etc. Adjective. No longer planned or scheduled. Steps. Noun. An advance or movement made from one foot to the other. A pace. Verb. To move the foot in walking. To advance or recede by raising and moving one of the feet to another resting place. Or by moving both feet in succession. Scans. Noun. Close investigation. Verb. To examine sequentially. Carefully. Or critically. To scrutinize. To behold closely. Mentions. Noun. A speaking or notice of anything. Usually in a brief or cursory manner. Used especially in the phrase make mention of. Verb. To make a short reference to something. Packaged. Verb. To pack or bundle something. Adjective. Having been placed in a package. Banker. Noun. One who conducts the business of banking. One who. Individually. Or as a member of a company. Keeps an establishment for the deposit or loan of money. Or for traffic in money. Bills of exchange. Etc. Anxious. Adjective. Nervous and worried. Contained. Verb. To hold inside. Adjective. Restricted in space. Ambulance. Noun. An emergency vehicle designed for transporting seriously ill or injured people to a hospital. Verb. To transport by ambulance. Says. Noun. A chance to speak. The right or power to influence or make a decision. Verb. To pronounce. Noun. A type of fine cloth similar to serge. Noun. Trial by sample. Assay. Specimen. Verb. To try. To assay. Noun. A strainer for milk. Dramatically. Adverb. In a dramatic manner. Care. Noun. Grief. Sorrow. Combines. Noun. A combine harvester. Verb. To bring. Two or more things or activities. Together. To unite. Reschedule. Verb. To schedule again or at a different time. Movements. Noun. 
physical motion between points in space. Neglect. Noun, the act of neglecting. Verb, to fail to care for or attend to something. Individual. Noun, a person considered alone, rather than as belonging to a group of people. Adjective, relating to a single person or thing as opposed to more than one. Never. Adverb, at no time, on no occasion, in no circumstance. Prosperous. Adjective, characterized by success. Handle. Noun, the part of an object which is, designed to be, held in the hand when used or moved. Introducing. Verb, of people, to cause, someone, to be acquainted, with someone else. Moments. Noun, a brief, unspecified amount of time. Losing. Verb, to cause, something, to cease to be in one's possession or capability due to unfortunate or unknown circumstances. Events or reasons. Noun, the process by which something is lost. A loss. Adjective, that loses or has lost. Beautiful. Noun, someone who is beautiful, can be used as a term of address. Adjective, attractive and possessing beauty. Sandy. Adjective, covered with sand. Sort. Noun, a general type. Lumbering. Noun, the act of one who lumbers. Heavy, clumsy movement. Adjective, clumsy or awkward. Mat. Noun, a flat piece of coarse material used for wiping one's feet, or as a decorative or protective floor covering. Verb, to cover. Protect or decorate with mats. Compassionate. Verb. To feel compassion. For someone or with regard to something. To regard. Someone or something. With compassion. Adjective. Having. Feeling or showing compassion. To or toward someone. Jump. Noun. The act of jumping. A leap. A spring. A bound. Verb. To propel oneself rapidly upward. Downward and or in any horizontal direction such that momentum causes the body to become airborne. Adjective. Exact. Matched. Fitting. Precise. Adverb. Exactly. Precisely. Noun. An occasion when a performer or team of them, especially in vaudeville, expects to perform at a theater for a single evening. Emails. Noun. A system for transferring messages from one computer to another. Usually through a network. Verb. To send an email or emails to. Noun. Enamel. Squirrel. Noun. Any of the rodents of the family Sciuridae distinguished by their large bushy tail. Verb. To store in a secretive manner. To hide something for future use. Education. Noun, the process of imparting knowledge, skill and judgment. Fixed. Verb, to pierce. Now generally replaced by transfix. Adjective, not changing, not able to be changed. Staying the same. Boost. Noun, a push from behind, as to one who is endeavoring to climb. Verb, to lift or push from behind. One who is endeavoring to climb. To push up. Drought. Noun, a period of unusually low rainfall, longer and more severe than a dry spell. Convert. Noun, a person who has converted to a religion. Verb, to transform or change something into another form, substance, state, or product. Aquarium. Noun, a tank, often made of glass, for keeping live fish or other aquatic animals. Condiments. Noun, something used to enhance the flavor of food, for example, salt or pepper. Being. Noun, a living creature. Conjunction, given that. Since. Lands. Noun, the part of earth which is not covered by oceans or other bodies of water. Verb, to descend to a surface. Especially from the air. Operate. Verb, to perform a work or labor. To exert power or strength, physical or mechanical, to act. Bond. Noun. Evidence of a long-term debt. By which the bond issuer, the borrower, is obliged to pay interest when due. And repay the principal at maturity.
as specified on the face of the bond certificate. The rights of the holder are specified in the bond indenture, which contains the legal terms and conditions under which the bond was issued. Bonds are available in two forms. Registered bonds and bearer bonds. Verb. To connect. Secure or tie with a bond. To bind. Gun. Noun. A device for projecting a hard object very forcefully. A firearm or cannon. Verb. With. Down. To shoot someone or something. Usually with a firearm. Adults. Noun. A fully grown human or animal. Deserved. Verb. To be entitled to, as a result of past actions, to be worthy to have. Duration. Noun. An amount of time or a particular time interval. Pudding. Verb. To place something somewhere. Noun. Instigation or incitement. Enticement. Alarm. Noun. A summons to arms, as on the approach of an enemy. Verb. To call to arms for defense. Full. Adjective. Containing the maximum possible amount that can fit in the space available. Adverb. Fully. Quite. Very. Thoroughly. Completely. Exactly. Entirely. Desk. Noun. A table. Frame. Our case. In past centuries usually with a sloping top but now usually with a flat top. For the use of writers and readers. It often has a drawer or repository underneath. Verb. To shut up. As in a desk. To treasure. Buying. Verb. To obtain. Something. In exchange for money or goods. Noun. The act of making a purchase. Orthopedic. Adjective. Of. Or relating to orthopedics. Else. Adjective. Used only with indefinite or interrogative pronouns. Other. In addition to previously mentioned items. Adverb. Follows interrogative adverbs. Otherwise. If not. Conjunction. For otherwise. Or else. Max. Noun. An extreme. A great extent. Verb. Usually without. To reach the limit. To reach the maximum. Adjective. Maximum. Maximal. Noun. The highest limit.